guys and welcome back to another review. So today we're doing a hand cream review from a brand called Defeel, which is short for Different Feel. I bought this on Shop Miss A for a dollar, but apparently from the actual brand itself, this is a six dollar product, so I got it for a steal. So this is 1.4 ounces, and it's their Rose Water Luxury Hand Cream. And on the back it reads, Nutrient enriched, the rich texture leaves hands soft and smooth, an antioxidant moisturizing hand and nail cream that provides silky hands and lasting comfort. Paraben free, no artific artificial coloring, keep out of reach of children, anti-aging and rejuvenating. Has a long ingredient list though, so what do we got? It is, um, it is Leaping Bunny certified though, so that's always good. Um... So, water, mineral oil, glycerin, PEG-40, stearate, cetyl alcohol, sterile alcohol, stearic acid, beeswax, glycerol stearate, SE, fragrance, phenoxyethanol, glycerol stearate, sorbitan stearate, dimethicone, PEG-100 stearate, triethan triethanolamine, carbamer, sunflower seed oil, ethyl hexoglycerin, DHT, tetrasodium glutamate, diacetate, uh, rose flower water, shea butter, sweet almond oil, hyaluronic acid, rose hip extract, cucumber seed extract, grapefruit peel extract, eucalyptus leaf extract, um, hypericum perfumatum flower leaf stem extract, and willow bark extract. So, can't claim it as an organic, but it does have some natural things in it. So... Hmm. It does have that lovely rose water scent. So I don't know, since I haven't used it before, how much is really needed. So it looks like toothpaste coming out. Like, look and feel like, oh, that is so soft. Ooh, okay. Thankfully, it doesn't feel like toothpaste. I'm like, oh, that is buttery. Yeah, I probably could have gotten away with using, like, Half of that. Now I know for future reference, and now so do you. But, ooh, that is lovely. Oh my god, it smells exactly like Avon Rose's roses. Oh my god, I love that. Ooh, that is nice. Nice. The fact that I got it for a dollar now, I'm like, I should go back to shop and say and get more of this, because wow. Wow. <laughs> I am thoroughly wowed already. Oh, that smells so good. Okay. So now I'm just seeing how long does it take to get it to absorb into the hands. I know that it's already definitely going faster than most, but there's definitely still some oily shininess you can still see. So we're gonna see. But so far, I'm like, okay, this is already better than... A lot of the competitions. Just saying. Just saying. Let me recap it though. Like, on first feel, I was like, it's kind of on par with the consistency of the Bath and Body Works aromatherapy lotions, but it is taking longer to sink in than those. Because I was going to say, dude, if this also, like, sinks in just as fast as that, who needs to spend that kind of money, but nah, nah, um, this does still take longer to absorb it, and who knows if it does 100%, so I'm starting to get the feeling that it might not, but even if it doesn't, like, this would be, like, a perfect one to use at night, put on a pair of gloves, sleep on it, wake up with super soft hands, you know? Or if you need it on your feet, same thing. Put it on, slap them some socks over them, and wake up with hella soft feet in the morning, you know? You get what I'm saying? So, it definitely has a time and a place, but I call some bullshit on their claim that it doesn't leave behind an oily residue. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Don't lie to me. But it's ultimately better than a lot of the competition. I will be honest about that. So... I don't know, if that's, like, the only thing against it, I think I'm giving it a 4 out of 5. Like, honestly, that ain't bad. 
That ain't bad at all. I like that. And for that scent, oh, I'm living for that scent. It's so nice. I'm kind of in love with it, not gonna lie. So, it doesn't replace my Bath and Body Works aromatherapy, but, but, I mean, as a cheaper, more everyday alternative, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. So, and they do have other scents. So, if rose isn't your thing, that's okay. They have others. So, anyway. Those are my thoughts. Take them or leave them. So <laughs> you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you'd like why do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link as always is down in the description. Anyway, guys, until next time, see ya.